First thing that we're going to do today, a little bit different, is we are going to learn our slate. Okay? Yeah. Um, the slate is very important because it's the first thing that um, any production that they're going to see. Okay. Even on your self tapes. Right. But especially when you get brought into the room. What's like the, because sometimes it says, to say it's like different stuff on the slate, mm -hmm. like specifically, what is the go-to, like just always, old name, age, how many Well, for you it would be, yeah. Name, age, and location. It's usually age only if you're under 18. Okay. If you're over 18, you usually don't reveal your age um, because you have an age range. Yeah. And they don't need to know all that information. But also, when you're getting those auditions, especially now, it's very detail-oriented to the specifics of what they want. So they're putting exactly what you should do in your slate. Yeah. Because a lot of slates now are self-tape. Mm -hmm. But for instance, which I'm going to teach you right now, is if you were to go to an in-person audition, mm -hmm. how your slate is usually going to go. Okay. Okay? So first they're going to say, hi, please slate for me. So I want you to introduce yourself, right, in a confident, pleasant way. Okay. Okay? Then I'm going to say, can you please um, give me your profiles? And you're going to turn to the left. Turn to the right, and then right back to camera. Okay. And the whole time, keep the same energy. energy. Right. Okay. So just name, age, location. Or just name. No, so in person, because you're there, so they're not going to want your location. Just right. So, yeah, the location is usually for self-tapes. Got it. Just because, uh -huh. you know, people in Chicago can say, oh, yeah, you know, I'm in L.A., but yeah. there's no way for them to know. And so then when it, all of a sudden they're like, okay, well, we're having a call back tomorrow yeah. and then the person can't show up. So that's why they want to know your location. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you can say your age since you're under 18. Okay. Hi, please slate for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page and I'm 17 years old. Are you looking into the camera? Oh, I don't know why I was looking at the phone. Or like whatever. Like, is that a phone? <laughs> <laughs> this is a battery. Oh. <laughs> so yes, <clears throat> the eye of the camera, okay? Anytime you see a camera, that is your safety net. That's where you should be comfortable. Got it. Okay, and please slate for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page and I'm 17 So, as soon as I said, hi, please slate for us. Oh, I'm Nicholas. <laughs> Got it. Like, <laughs> you know, take a breath. Okay. Yeah. Relax. Okay. Calm. It's not like the the sprint is really like. <laughs> March. <laughs> you set. Okay. And hi, please slate for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page, and I'm 17 years old. And please show us your profiles. Okay. What do you think we are missing, Nicholas? The energy. Yes, and what's one way to convey energy? Dance. <laughs> See that beautiful smile? Yeah, smile. That was not there. Oh, okay. When you see someone and they're walking up to you, if they're smiling, do you feel, what, what do you feel? You like feel more connected. Yeah. You feel like friendly, like someone yeah. that's not gonna just I yeah, <laughs> and then you just like pull out a sword, right? Okay. <clears throat> so yeah, so that was actually pretty good, but your face just looked like you okay. didn't want to be there. <laughs> and your smile is even if you don't want to be somewhere, even if your heart is yeah beating literally. <laughs> see, they can't hear that. Yeah. But they can see, right? They can see your face. So your heart can be, but if you're smiling, they're gonna think, oh, okay. That's we what like this guy. the actors do. <laughs> That's what we do. Got it. <clears throat> Hi, please slay for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page and I'm 17 years old. And please show us your profile. Okay, let's try one more time. So we're gonna do the wave either at the beginning or the end. Like with the eye. Mm -hmm. okay. And 
when you're slating, so once you do your turn, keep the smile. same smile. You don't have to stop back at the camera. Oh, okay. You can turn all the way to the other side okay. and then back to camera with the smile. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Hi, please slay for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page and I'm 17 years old. And please show us your profiles. Bam! But, oh, I wanted to give you all the credit in the world to say that was it. But you know what you messed up at the very end? What? You didn't follow through. You had a question immediately after. Yeah, I did, because I didn't feel it. Like, I didn't think it wasn't there. You have to trust yourself, because it actually was it. It was. It was. Because it's not about if you wave or not. Right? It's about your your energy. So your wave actually matched. Okay. So it doesn't matter if it came at the beginning or the end. Okay. It just, you know, it was a friendly wave, right? Yeah. But what you messed up is you have to, in acting, even if you mess up, right. let me tell you that okay. you messed up. Let the director say you messed up. Let the casting say, oh, what was that? Right. Do not judge yourself. If you're judging yourself, that means you're not fully the character. And even though right now all you have to do is slate, mm -hmm. but your slate is being the character version of yourself that is extremely happy um, all the time. Mm -hmm. yeah. Even though we know <laughs> that no one's happy all the time, but we want to believe that this is how you are all the time. Got it. Right? And this is how you're going to be on set. Yeah. You're going to be cool, calm, and friendly. You have to stay in that. Okay. Do not judge yourself. Okay? If you stay in that habit, you're going to do it when you're doing your scenes. Mm -hmm. So you'll be thinking, dang, did I do that right? Instead of you being the character, living and breathing in that moment. Yeah. Right? Okay. All right, All right one last time. Okay. Please lay for us. Hi, my name is Nicholas Page, and I'm 17 years old. And please give us your profiles. Great. Now, Nicholas, are you willing to shave? Yes. <laughs> All right, perfect. And do you know the reason for the slip? It's kind of a way to show your personality rather than just obviously like saying your name and your location and all that stuff, but more to like show your personality because a self tape doesn't really need to show a lot of that. Right. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, especially for commercials because they happen so quick, a lot of times they won't actually watch your audition. So the first, oh, um, yeah, a lot of times. And I work with a couple of casting directors, not all the time, but if you have 500 tapes sure. and you know that you're gonna do a callback and you're gonna have the directors um, or you're gonna have the ad agency on the callback coming in, a lot of times what they'll do is they'll go for the look. And especially nowadays, because a lot of people don't have headshots that look exactly like they're supposed to, which is how you actually look, right? Um, especially with the pandemic. So some people haven't changed their headshots in like three years. So the person that's actually in the room is not the same person that they actually thought right. they were selecting. So they can see now in real time what you look like and your personality. And if it's for a food product, that's why they have you show your hands. Just make sure that you have all your fingers and you don't have any tattoos or something. Because if it's a, say, a Subway commercial, unless they're trying to market that. But then they'll usually ask right. for individuals with tattoos. Most of the time in any type of arena, a person wants to know that if we bring you in, that you're going to be confident and you have like the charisma and you have the skills to actually do the job because a lot of money is on the line. Yeah. So the casting director, let's say they hire you, right? And you're like fidgeting <laughs> and you're very nervous. Yeah. But they're like, you know, what we really like his eyes. So let's just give him a chance. But then on set, 
you're unable to perform, uh, who's never going to get hired in? Me. Besides you. <laughs> that casting director. Oh, sure. From the ad agency. <laughs> right? So, so there are jobs on the line as well. Yeah. And time is money. And so the slate is the easiest way to be able to see if somebody is green, which means new. And in most industries, if you're green, it's, it's a good thing. It's a cute thing, but not in the entertainment industry because everyone's job is on the line. So like, when you say green, what does that mean? It means that, you don't, that you're new, that you don't know what you're doing, okay. basically. That you're just getting into acting, right? right? Mm -hmm. So, so don't, I don't well, understand. for instance, if you don't know how to slate, then right away we know that you haven't yeah. been auditioning. Right? If you're not comfortable in the room, we know that you're not used to having these opportunities. Mm -hmm. So if you come off as charismatic and confident and loose, the first thing that they're thinking is, oh, this is someone who's been doing this for a while. He must have been doing you know, theater since he was a kid. Right. You know? Or he must book a lot. Okay. But if you're you know, twitching and nervous, <laughs> it's like... Uh, you know, good job, and they'll smile and nod, but you'll never get the call. Yeah. Got it? Got it.